So you know, by living and loving, Bree and Seth find themselves right now at this very place, this very day, gathered together with all of you and with God, their family and friends. I don't know about you, but today has been the best day of my life. And here in a short time, you become my wife. I love you so much, and over these past four years and a handful of months have been the most important and greatest months of my life. And today starts the first day of the rest of our lives together. And John 4.16 says, And so we know and rely on the love God has for us. God is love. Whoever lives in love lives in God, and God in them. Babe, I love you with everything that I am, and I thank God for you every day. He has blessed me in so many ways, and you are the best blessing I could ever ask for. And I'll never forget the first time I saw you. I fell in love with you right away, and I loved you then, I love you now, and I always love you till death do us part. I promise you, i always and forever love you, to comfort you, to cherish you, to give you my all, to provide for you, to hold you, to carry you. I promise to always put you first. I love you, Bree, with everything I am, and words can't describe how blessed I am to be marrying you. And Seth, remember this moment. Because before this moment, you have been many things to one another. You've been friends, companions, lovers, and even teachers. For you have learned much from one another. But now, you shall say a few words that will take you across the threshold of life. And you know, things will never quite be the same between you. For after these vows, you shall say to the entire world, this is my husband. This is my wife. God, you have so consecrated the covenant of Christian marriage that in it is represented the covenant between Christ and this couple. I ask you to send forth your blessing upon Seth and Bree, that they may surely keep their marriage covenant and grow in love and godliness together. Now that Seth and Bree have given themselves to each other by solemn vows, joining of hands, giving and receiving of rings, I announce to you they are husband and wife. Those whom God has joined together, let no one separate. Are you ready? <laughs> Everybody else ready? Yeah. All right. Will you please, Seth, kiss your bride.
Wow, today is the day that we are united as one. You treated me like a princess from day one. You were sweet, genuine, funny, and of course handsome. I thought maybe it was too good to be true, but year after year, your kind and gentleman ways continued to win me over. When you surprised me with the trip to California for my birthday, I had no clue that this trip would be the one, the one that started this new journey in our lives. I turn around to change my camera lens, turn back around and there you were. In that moment, I may not have cried or jumped around, but those were the most exciting four words I'd ever heard, finally. Thank you. Thank you for working so hard to provide for our family and being a man of faith. I love you with my entire being and cannot wait for what's to come. I know God will provide for us what we need, so let the adventure begin.